Have, have we got the decision? Okay, okay. Yeah. Yes. Have we got the decision? Yeah. Okay. People are going well, the power is created by section 69 of the Criminal Justice and Public Order Act 1980-94 and as a senior officer present, I am directing you to leave this land. If you fail to do so as soon as practical, you will commit a criminal offence and can be arrested. It is also an offence to return to this land within three months. It is now 8.25 by my watch. I give you till Could, could we speak to somebody? He's the guy to speak to. He's uh, he's going to be speaking. Sorry, you're blocking us in. Do you want to speak to somebody? Yeah, I want to speak to the guy in charge. Okay, give us a second. We'll call him over. Oh, okay, but we're not allowed to pass through. You're saying because the guy's just instructed people to leave. So it's a bit confusing that you're keeping us in. You can't come back in. Yeah. So if you want to walk out now, but we won't be letting you back in. Have you got? Have you got? Have you got well, I just want to speak with this guy here. Yeah, in, I'm, in, which I'm case, in which case, best thing to do is stay there. Well, we, we, we've had a couple of meetings. It's been made. I'm so good to just talk to because we can bring this level down. Um, uh, so the has been made, but we're. The governor said basically we're, 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 you've been giving your warnings, so he's got nothing more to say. But, uh, surely it's civil government. for us to talk and, and I, I, I can tell you the decision that's been made. Um, that's, that's fine. If you want to talk to someone senior, just be busy yeah. and work sort of stuff out. I'll try and call our boss over. Okay? Um, if it's right, because this is very intimidating. Yeah, it this is. is ridiculous. You're, to you're, accuse us of being intimidating, sitting down in tents. When the people organising Canada Day know what we're doing here, we've all been spoken of them. To be honest, the intimidating bit's just part of the legislation, it's just a small part. I believe it's more the obstruction. Yeah, we say so you're right in the middle of Parla uh, Trafalgar Square, so yeah. causing a bit of an obstruction, that's the issue. Not any intimidation. We, we know that we're not obstructing. Yeah, if you bear with that. me, I'm not going to go and approach him. I'll have to tell my sergeant when he goes up to my phone. Uh, do you want to tell your sergeant? Yeah. An inspector or chief inspector. What's it regarding? Uh, it's just for these guys here so we can uh, communicate, especially if, if we speak to the leader, obviously someone who's are in you, charge. Are you kind of acting as a representative for the guys in here? Uh, I'm independent media, so I'm acting on behalf of, of people, anyone. Uh, obviously want to protect these people's rights. Uh, they want to speak with someone who's in charge. I feel the best person is an inspector or chief inspector. Uh, you've, got, you, you've got an inspector right here, he's just walking there with the two, two pips on. If he can come over, he can speak with us. You know, within like a good time scale. What, what is he want? Because obviously, the reason we're here is to obviously get you No, out. yeah, we, we understand that. We, we've already made a decision. We've also the aims to the kind of the square people, and we just want to tell talk to him about that. Right, okay. yeah. Yeah. No, you don't want to speak to him, you want to speak to the chief. Uh, yeah. Well, he went for um. Because he, he was the one that was calling all the shots last night. That's why I wanted to find him. Yeah, but he's, he's the um, person from the GLA. But don't you find this intimidating? What's that? 
surrounding everyone like in a square box of police so officers. We're not trying to intimidate. It, it does. It feels like it. It feels. It feels a lot intimidating. We're not trying to kill you because if you want to leave, you leave. No, no, I understand that, but it, it does look like a kettle. If you you haven't explained it to these people, some of them might think that they're in a well, kettle. Obviously, you're, you're speaking okay. to these people. I'm doing a specific job here. If mm. you want to explain to them, they can leave at any time, unobstructed, then that's fine. It would be good and good for uh, an inspector to come over. There was an inspector early on who came over yeah, and spoke to us quite nicely. Well. He, he can come over and speak with the guys. Well, like I say, and myself and my sergeant, we've sent out the command chain. They're obviously dialogue with a load of people at the moment, so as soon as they're available, hopefully someone will come and talk to you. I understand that, but I thought that would have been the first thing to do instead of obviously a, a surrounding the police. I mean, if you want to tell these people that we're not kettling them, we're not containing them, I just feel it'd be better for an inspector to come and speak with the people. What we don't want is obviously people to hang around with them. We want it to be controlled. Once people leave, then we're happy. Simple well, no, this is the funny thing. People will actually, that's what was the, the people were discussing and before you turned up. you decided to leave anyway, well, we're, we're, as you can understand, we wasn't able to uh, to finish talking because of the uh, uh, the presence of the police here. Because our first impression was you've come to arrest us. No, no, uh, that's, that's that's what it appears. That's I, I, I explain though. That no, no, I, I understand. I understand. He's he's explained that over the uh, over the radio. But I just wonder what, what it would feel like if, uh, let's say, let, let's let's turn it on extremes. Let's say a uh, black block. Uh, 10 or 20 black blocks surrounded you, would you feel comfortable with that? Or would you feel intimidated? Or forget if it's black block I mean, or anyone. To be perfectly honest, I'm not in a position to give my, my personal opinion to you. Well, you should and be I, able I hope, to. I hope you can understand that. No, no, I understand. The uniform does restrict. But that's the other thing. If that I wasn't you in the uniform, if we were in a pub talking, you know, I'd happily give you my opinion. But at the end of the day, I'm doing a job. It's all been explained to you, the legal side of it. Um, I've tried to help you explain, uh, trying to get the governor over. Oh, okay. Day, it's been explained to you. Everyone's free to leave at any point they wish to leave. No, people are leaving. Yeah. People, that's what exactly. that's what's already been uh, planned. But this this doesn't really help what's happening here. It's, it's it's not very. It seems like a lot of waste of money. On top of that, intimidation. I do feel intimidated by it. I'm, I know you, I know you've explained. If you've got any issues, then obviously mm. you've got. That's obviously reasonable. why I'm recording now as well. Because I, I, reasonable I, channels you can go down. All I can do is pass out the command chain. I've, I've, you know, like I say, I've explained it to you. But you don't. You couldn't say that from your 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 own perspective that this does look like a bit over the top. Not obliged to give my opinion. What am you Thirty of us. I would say about 150, that's what it looks like.